If you want to better engage with your audience during presentations and get insightful analytics on how it went, live polling is the way to go. In this video, we're walking through how to easily set up live polls in Glisser, and we're sharing our top tips to make the most of this feature. Feel free to follow along step by step while you work on your own presentation by pausing and starting this video at your own pace. Let's get into it. Step number one, log into your Glisser account, then head to the presentations tab. Choose the presentation you want to add a poll to, then click the orange button titled Add Content. Step number two, choose what type of poll you want to add. You'll see options for opinion polls, ratings, free text, and date picker polls. Let's start by adding an opinion poll. You can use this style of poll for lots of different purposes. They're great for breaking the ice at the beginning of a presentation by asking the audience to answer a lighthearted question like how their commute was. Or you can ask the audience an opinion question at the beginning and test to see if their opinion has changed after the presentation is over. You can also use picture answers instead for a fun added touch. For example, if there's a big sports tournament currently happening, you can ask your audience who they're cheering for by using team logos as answer options. With opinion polls, you can add up to 16 text answers or 8 image ones, but we recommend keeping the choices to a minimum so you don't overwhelm your audience. You can also customize the poll by choosing whether you want to make answering mandatory, have the option to select multiple answers, or share results live to the audience. Let's move on to step number three and add a rating poll. The process is very similar to the opinion poll where you add your question and customize the settings, but with a rating poll, you choose how many stars you want to include. To keep things simple, choose between five or ten stars. Rating polls are also great for getting live feedback from your audience during your sessions. You can keep the answers hidden from the audience so only you can see the results. Otherwise, you can choose to share live poll results instantly to your audience's devices. Now let's add a free text poll to gather some detailed audience feedback. With this option, the audience members can type out their own answers, making for a great opportunity to gain some insights on your audience's priorities and needs. You can then use the information to improve your future business decisions. Ask your sales and marketing team what information would be most useful to them so you can set up your polling questions accordingly. And that's it! Adding polls is super easy within Glisser, and you don't have to worry about changing screens or doing some complicated switching during your presentations. It's a great way to keep your audience engaged during the session, and you'll get really useful insights from your audience to inspire your next event. Best of luck with your presentation.